Dear Father, I am no longer on the cars. As I've already written to Mom, I was at the rear of the front by the lower part of the Isonzo, only for a short span of 10 days. I've been in the upper Isonzo Valley for almost a whole month now, on that famous highland, which we conquered during the latest offensive. Our unit proved very brave in combat. We sleep in a cave and suffer from the cold, because of ceaseless snowstorms, which have been raging since I came here. But I've already gotten used to it. I couldn't believe that I would ever be able to fall asleep in such unbearable conditions. But one gets used to everything. Just imagine, even the mortars can't wake me anymore. We have learned to recognize the shells by sound. The 75mm caliber shell screeches. The 149mm makes a snoring sound. The 152 caliber whistles. And the 305 caliber wails. This noise and the din have become quite an ordinary thing. Otherwise, I am okay. And I feel fine. I don't deplore and miss my place too much. I only miss you, my nearest and dearest. All of you. Because I don't know when I can see you again. As for these feelings, I don't have sufficient inner strength. Especially in the evenings, I am seized by homesickness. And I am with you in my thought. I hope and dream with my eyes open. Such feelings are terrible. Then, the dreams dissolve. All of a sudden, you are a soldier again. And you see the mountains and the rivers. And again, you hear the rumble of guns 